The following is a selected video from MasterTheContent.com, where you will find an extensive video library of lectures for a variety of standardized admission tests. We offer over 600 hours of detailed video lectures for a multitude of standardized tests. Use our interactive in-lecture table of contents to find specific topics of interest. Work through numerous in-lecture examples to help you internalize concepts. To learn more, visit MasterTheContent.com. Your career, our passion. We're going to discuss an important concept referred to as the ISO uh, electric point. Because of the simple fact that we are dealing with dipolar ions and twitter ions, it's really important for us to understand what the isoelectric point is. And there's actually a pretty good definition of it on the screen right there. So the isoelectric point is basically the pH at which the concentration of the dipolar ion, the twitter ion, is maximum, is at its maximum, and the concentrations of anions and cations are equal. So they cancel each other out. In this case, the ion will have no net electrical charge. So that is what we refer to as the isoelectric point, which is denoted by that symbol right there. So um, as you can see at the bottom of the screen right there, we have the non-ionic form of what is a generic amino acid. So it's a generic amino acid. And what actually happens under physiological conditions and at a pH of about 7, uh, it will actually exist in its Zwitter ionic form, in its Zwitter ionic form in which we have a negative charge of that carboxyl group right there, and we have what is essentially a positive charge of that amino group right there. So these two charges will cancel each other out, and a Zwitter ion, or well, this Zwitter ionic form, will be relatively neutral. Okay, so the Zwitter ion is a neutral species, and that's what you need to take away from the slide. You need to take away that and you need to understand what the isoelectric point is. So the concentration at the isoelectric point, the concentration of, of the Zwitter ion is at its maximum, and the, uh, the concentration of the cations and the anions are equal, so they cancel each other out, and for that reason, the ion will carry no net electrical charge.